Imagine a drone that could fly over 2,000 miles per hour. So high the pilots who launched it could barely track it. This was the Lockheed D-21, a spy drone born from the same mines that built the SR-71. In the early 1960s, Lockheed Skunk Works set out to create a reconnaissance craft faster and fly higher than anything before. It was unmanned, unstoppable, and designed for one-way missions deep into enemy airspace. The D-21 carried a single high-resolution camera, captured its images, dropped the film capsule for recovery, and then self-destructed. Originally launched from the back of a modified A-12 called the M-21, it hit speeds beyond Mach 3.3. But disaster struck in 1966. A failed launch destroyed both aircraft and killed one crewman. Lockheed regrouped, adapting the drone for launch from a B-52 Stratofortress with a rocket booster to reach ramjet speed. The new D-21B finally flew successfully and was deployed on covert missions over China's Lopnor nuclear test site under the code name Senior Bowl. Four flights were made between 1969 and 1971, none fully successful. With spy satellites taking over the job, the D-21 program was canceled in 1971. While only 38 were built, a few survive in museums, sleek black reminders of an era when speed, secrecy, and risk went hand in hand. If you love Cold War aviation, hit like and subscribe for more stories from the History Hangar.